वेलकम टू माय साइट फॉर डायरीज योर अल्टीमेट गाइड टू डिजिटल एक्सपीरियंस एक्सेलेंस योर गो टू चैनल फॉर ऑल द थिंग्स इन साइट कोर एट डॉट नेट सो दिस इज द वीडियो फ्रॉम द फ्राइडे स्पेशल क्विक टेक बाइक वीडियो सीरीज वेर वी ट्राई टू आंसर फ्यू इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड फ्यू टर्मिनोलॉजीज इन डिफरेंट डिफरेंट टेक्नोलॉजी सो हु आई एम I am Jitendra Ghanekar. I am in Sitecore Technology MVP 2024. I am a technical architect in one of the uh, company in the Mumbai. So, what is today's question uh, in this video? So, let's see what the question for today. So, can you explain blue green deployment in the context of .NET applications? So, so it can be a interview question for you can you explain blue green deployment in the context of dotnet application blue green deployment is a release management strategy designed to minimize downtime and reduce risk during application updates so blue green deployment is a release management strategy where we try to minimize the downtime and uh, reduce the risk uh, during the application update now how we are doing it the main idea is to maintain two identical production environment one you called as a blue environment and other you called as a green environment so there will be two identical uh, environment where we can switch anytime and uh, which will give you the same result so one is you called as a blue another you called as a green environment so how will you do how will you set up that the first thing is a uh, setup so you have to set up the blue uh, your currently live environment and green your new uh, new version to be deployed so you will have a two uh, same identical server set up on your uh, landscape or your environment the next stage is the deployment so you deploy the new version to the green environment while the blue environment is still serving all the production traffic so at the time you will deploy only on the one environment so say you are deploying on the green environment while you are testing on the green in, green in, in uh, environment your production site is pointed to the blue environment and is still serving with the, uh, the production traffic so you do not have to um, uh, you do not have to make uh, your site down for the deployment third thing is a testing so once the deployment to the green environment is complete you perform thorough testing so you do the testing and to ensure that a newer version works correctly so once all the things are completed all the testing uh, use cases are completed and you are 100% sure that your deployment doesn't made any any unwanted changes or unwanted effect then then you say that green environment com com environment is complete and it is ready for the use then you switch the traffic so once you deployed it everything on the uh, uh, green deployed environment it is functioning correctly then what we have to do is we have to switch the production uh, uh, which is pointing to the blue environment to the green once you switch that uh, traffic the all the live uh, traffic will come to your green environment the next take is a rollback strategy so if there is any problem how will you roll back it so if any issue arise after the switch it's straight forward to revert traffic back to the blue environment so if there is any problem then you just switch it to the blue environment there will be minimum downtime and impact on the users clean up once the new version is green it's confirmed to be stable uh, once it is everything is stable then the blue environment can be updated for the next redeployment of a cycle effectively becoming the standby environment so that will become your standby environment so this process is called as a blue green deployment so what the advantage we get from this blue to blue green deployment first is the reduce the downtime so downtime time is get to reduce you can quickly roll back the changes and they improve the risk management the risk is reduced so this is what the blue green deployment uh, in the context of a .NET application. So if you want to have a detailed uh, video, the full fledged video on this topic, let me know. You can put, uh, you can comment on the, uh, the below the video and then I can, I can prepare a full fledged video on this. 
for now let's summarize the blue green deployment so basically you will have a uh, it's it's a deployment strategy where you will have a two environment blue environment and green environment you first test everything on your uh, your uh, green environment it, if it's work fine then only you switch uh, switch the blue to green and then once green is a completely uh, what you say a completely stable then you deploy it on the blue environment so that's how you will move blue green deployment all right we are done for today uh if you like this video please click on a like button to share this with your friends and click if you are new to the cha channel or till now you are not subscribed to the channel uh, i will i will request you to consider subscribing to our channel my site called diaries and click on that notification bell to get latest update thank you thanks for watching